If it turns out at some point you're not interested in selling on Fiverr anymore, that's okay. There are a lot of tools you can use in life and there's only so much time and energy you can have to use them. In full transparency in this course, at the time of getting towards the end of finishing this course, I have no more active gigs on Fiverr. I have paused all of my gigs because here's the reality I'm facing. I have hundreds of thousands of students on Udemy. I have more than I can even handle on Udemy alone and I'm doing some inspirational videos on Facebook and YouTube and I'm trying to do my best as a dad, a husband, and to have some time to play with my friends and go to my support group each day. I have very little available time and energy to do anything and the opportunities I have pay very well now and I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful for you being a part of that in this course. So that means Fiverr, if you have other things, jobs, if you have other gigs you're doing, freelancing on other websites or contract work, Fiverr may not pay enough for you. And even for me now, Joseph Delgadio, who's a co-instructor on this course, has actually managed the Fiverr gigs on my account for around a year now. Now, originally Joseph wasn't making a whole lot because I didn't have a whole lot I could pay him. Now, Joseph is averaging uh, around over 50 plus dollars an hour to do work with me, plus getting a percentage of course sales. Does it make sense now for me to have be paying Joseph $50 an hour to fool around with Fiverr gigs? Now that I've completed and our account collectively has completed around 100 gigs on Fiverr, 83 completed, 14 canceled, I've learned enough from Fiverr now to see that there's no good opportunity that practically makes sense for me to have the gigs I have up and running right now and that my efforts are best spent on Udemy. That's my reality today. Now there's all kinds of options I know are there on Fiverr if say something happens and I need to pivot and change how I'm working online. I have the peace of mind to know that Fiverr is there and that I could potentially have a full-time income if I worked full-time on Fiverr. And at the same time, I'm willing to accept that due to my own limitations, it doesn't make sense to offer any gigs right now. So if it, after all of this, you see, you know what, maybe offering gigs isn't the way for me to go right now, that's okay. When you see how little limited time and energy you have, Usually the logical decision is to put everything into whatever is giving you the biggest return. So Udemy is giving me the biggest return right now. That's why I'm here talking about Fiverr on you with Udemy instead of out consistently working on Fiverr on my own. I hope this experience has been useful for you in realizing my own limitations. I've brought a lot of other people who've worked more than me on Fiverr together here with you on Udemy. And I hope that between everything all of us have said, You've got everything you need by now to either be successful on Fiverr, to use Fiverr what you need it for, or to say, you know what, maybe not Fiverr right now, maybe it's there for later if I need it. Thanks for watching.